Hey, this is Dave again for the Shepherd School, and today I want to talk to you about this auto personal portable oven. And the company that makes it makes 12 volt, 24 volt, and this house current one. And basically, it's just a like a insulated, aluminized lunch bag with this hot plate in it. Okay. And uh, you put a plastic container, but we went down to Walmart and bought this um, Pyrex dish. Fits in nice and perfect. Says the biggest kind of container you can put it in is nine by six and three quarters by three inches high. All right. But uh, basically, what you do, you put your food in it, and uh, it'll cook. It says if you cook raw food, it's kind of like a slow cooker. It takes two or three hours to uh, to heat up. Um, frozen three or four hours says it'll do leftovers in 30 to 40 minutes but basically you when you plug it up it heats till it gets to 239 degrees Fahrenheit and then it will re auto reduce the temperature down to about 150 149 degrees Fahrenheit so it'll keep it warm but it won't burn it uh, I've been wanting to mess with one of these I really wanted the 12 volt one but uh, the company sent me this uh, for a review and they sent me the house current one so I'm not complaining I'm gonna play with it there are lots of different uh, websites blogs Kindle books videos using these uh, 12 volt uh, slow cookers for truckers truckers use these quite a bit from from what I've heard but what I'm gonna make with it we're just gonna try something easy because I haven't really done anything with this is we're just going to make us some macaroni and cheese. So let me get the cord out of the way. And I'm not going by any recipe. I'm just going to put the thing in there. And I got regular old Walmart box macaroni. Boop! There it is. And I'm just going to cover it with some water. Put the lid on it. Here, let me do that out. Put the lid on it. Put it out of the way. Plug it up. We'll come back and I'll probably check it every hour or so. And see what happens. So I cooked it a little too long. I got to reading the book, and uh, it got a little mushy. But in an hour, I have when I first checked it in an hour, it was it was soft. It looked like uh, macaroni, but I put too much water in it, so I kept it going, and it kept it going for like three hours. And so uh, a lot of the macaroni has rendered down. But uh, there's a lot of potential in this device. As I was reading about it on Amazon, they were talking about using it to reheat food at the office. And, you know, you don't have smells and stuff like using a microwave. Uh, there's a lot of potential, and I think it's really cool. I think I'm going to try to make me some chicken and rice next. But for the price and for the capability, I think this is pretty awesome. I think if you car camp, have an RV... Um, drive a truck, anything with uh, good access to 12 volt. I personally, I think I'd rather have the 12 volt version than the plug in the wall version. But uh, I think it's a winner. I just think I need to refine my technique.